I thought I had more. Was it? Wait, wait, what? What? Wait, I don't. There we go. That's how you do it. Thought I'd noticed that before. Good. Carriers are on the go. Working fine. Then we're gonna put these on Kona's East. Is east, so we're increasing our naval power here now with our battleship fleets and all that. Whew. Feels good to be powerful, don't it? Mm -mm -mm. These guys are heading down here to Mexico. And I think they will. That will be our next move, but somewhere, sometime in 1937. Definitely not now. Uh, to be honest, that's will be a little crazy. Oh, look who's done! Look who's done! I think we'll deploy him down here in Texas. I. Don't know what's going on. Okay, sorry about that. Shit like that happens sometimes. <laughs> this is an armored core. First army. Oorah. Well, they're weak, but it's, yeah, that. That'll be good once they hit the shit. Well, especially once they actually gear up and start learning how to fight. Once they grow, should I say. Um... Oops. You always gotta keep an eye on that. Because it can really suck. If you don't. Uh, I've, I've geared my country into like 30 in descent. And they're like pissed as hell. <laughs> I didn't understand it until I... Uh, got uprisings and shit. But yeah, so keep an eye on that. That's a good, important thing to do. Um, these infantry divisions are soon done as well. I th I'd say it's pretty swell. <laughs> Funny jokes. 101. Um... Yeah, great. Demonstrate against the Great War. Greater one is coming, so yeah, you gotta better, better j tingle your tingle your jingles before this comes up. So yeah, these air bases are gonna finish up pretty quickly. Not sure if they're gonna be super needed, but you never know. The Brits and Russians and shit might invade us, especially the Russians. Could you imagine that? Like fucking world in conflict. That's technically possible. Fucking slow down. I lost uh, contact with my keypads. Whoa. Okay, so we got quite a few divisions here, haven't we? There's ten of them. Two more cores. Yippee. Athens. Iron Horse. Nope, gotta go with the new army here. Chaffee. The rest of the lads have got their shit. Let's put this guy at the east. No, let's get an army group. Franklin, sounds good. And we'll attach that one to the Conus. And gotta do a little minor reorganizational thing here. Uh. First army, you are going in under the army group. So we're talking 200, we're talking about 300,000 men here, uh, unmobilized. And we're talking probably half a million when mobilized. So it's not bad for just covering our, our side of the Atlantic, so to speak. Um, I think I'm going to abort these two as soon as they're done, because it's going to go for another cycle. Remember that, how I put it to serial? Which means it's going to continue going, but, uh, but, uh, yeah. I don't know if that's going to be necessary, though, because I'm cramming out all the IC I will possibly ever need down here. Apparently that's going to be done later on. Too bad. We 
We got fucking peasants rising up ahead us. What the fuck? Where? Here? Quell the unrest. Quell the unrest. 33rd Golden Cross NG Division. Quell it. Send the fleets. <laughs> oh yeah, and if I touch a transport fleet, they'll actually... Yeah. They'll go with them. And I think we got two transport fleets, right? I think they're both attached. Oh, this one isn't. I better put it here. I don't know what it's called. Pacific Transport Fleet. I'm, I better change that. What's the other one called? The one I have up here. Atlantic Transport Fleet. Ah, fuck it. Might as well be codenamed Pacific one. Although, we, although they're not going to be doing any Pacific stuff. Specific stuff, huh? Instead of specific stuff. Okay, so... What's this? Baltimore. Maybe somewhere in Canada where it wasn't entirely hyped up. We could need some up here. <laughs> no, it's going to be pointless. Eh. EP map mode. We can't place it here because it's apparently, is it already full? Really, it's crammed out. We'll just throw them down in Baltimore, though. A little bit casually there. Um, and then we'll, we're going to board it. Oh, takes up a lot. Really does. Maybe I went a little bit overkill with air bases, but uh, you don't get it. They're they're gonna be needed. They will. But it's times ten, so are they gonna? Re yeah, they restart. That's a bummer. See, that is going to take some time. But you see, I'll, I'll see how far we get until the real war begins, and then we can stop stop doing all that stuff. I want to join the Axis as well. I'm on my good way down there. But you know what? Next episode, we're going to grab some oil down here in Mexico. Mexico. Actually, no, we're just going to... We're just going to do it like this. Can you fucking slow down, you piece of shit? Here we go. We're going to mobilize... We're going to watch our manpower pool just drain to nothing. Look at that shit. <laughs> Alright. I want to see how strong we are when standing like this. Oh, 400,000. Not bad, not bad. Can deploy a few more guys now. Oh, a rocket test site. Um, we put it somewhere cool, like in... Halifax. Why not? I'm gonna need some more AA there, though, to defend it, but, uh... We could sort that out later. It's not my VP. I've, I've conquered the area. It's... Well, it kinda is, but... Eh, it's not a VP, so... It doesn't fall under that jurisdiction, or whatever I should put it. Um... Okay, boys. Let's go to war against Mexico. Fuck you. That's all I can say. Fuck you, Mexico. What you got, bitch? <laughs> oh. We're sinking some of these guys here and there. It's gonna be nice owning all of this, too. All of this desert and all of this winter. It's gonna be like... We're gonna be like bigger than Russia. Almost. I mean, not really, but... You never know. I mean, we're going to be a good, good two-thirds of it or something. I don't know, maybe less than that. Judging by this, we're going to... Well, we're going to fill up quite a big big amount. It's going to be cool, nonetheless. Battle of, was that the Battle of Alamo? That's it. I think it's the Battle of Alamo. No, no one's dying. They're just pulling out. Fucking faggots. I have no idea why they're doing that to me. Oh, bit of combat here. But mostly they're retreating if it's like an HQ. The UK still wants us in, though. They're like, yeah, well, you know, we can we can make an exception. It's the Americans, so, you know, what the hell? Come on. <laughs> Fucking faggots. They're gonna want me to be an Axis. You just wait. Thing is, I played as, like... 
played as allies quite a lot, actually. I, I mean, Australia was allies. So I guess that's the only allies one I've done. Shit. I've never done a common turn. I was obviously Axis when I was Japanese. No, I don't think I... No, I didn't join anyone. I was like... Um, I think I joined the allies at the end, so... It's really been only be, really been the Italians and the Germans this far, I guess. But, uh, yeah. Two allies, then. Zero common turns. There's gonna be a third Axis. Maybe I'll make a common turn sometime. But I probably won't play as Russia, though. Uh, horrendously big. Maybe it's, maybe I'll be Finland and I'll join them. Or if that's if that's possible. I guess everything's possible in this game. But maybe I'll even go. No, I can't. I can't swap from Axis as like a German and become common turn. But uh, that'd be a pretty cool fight though. Germany and I honestly think Germany and Russia would beat America and Britain at that time. Not today, but at that time. That would be pretty sick. Be a, quite a, a lengthened war. I think, I'd feel bad for Britain if America didn't actually protect them too much. Because, you know, they're going to have everything here <laughs> on that. Nah. Getting really the wrong idea here. Sitting and making up new history. Ah, uh, the fleet is really just doing what they want to do. Just chilling around here. Mexican fleet has probably been taken care of since long. Apparently we're not being reinforced, and I gotta fix that, of course. That can be. Dum -da 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 -da. Starting here on the coastal ports and naval bases now, because we're clearing up a lot of IC, so that's great. Doesn't really cost anything. I mean, compared to like 10. So. Yeah, it's gonna be done before 1940 at least. Mountain troops, that's great be needed. Oh god, I gotta fucking... Oh, I think Japan did some sick shit. Yep. They're at war in China now. The, the Sino-Japanese war is underway. Good luck, Japan. I'll be allying you sometime soon. Don't you fucking attack me now. <laughs> you can take this Philippines, though. That's okay. Now, they're gonna go Axis as well, I think. And over here in Europe, it's all calm. But do they know that in two years it would be it would lay waste to the continent? Hmm. Poor people. Lost sixteen and they lost twenty. Pretty good kill ratio. Could imagine how they're defending the streets here in Pashuka. And then they're retreating and they're shooting at us with their bolt action rifles and we're shooting them back with their bolt action rifles and we're running down the street and some grenades are being thrown and I don't know. That's it really. It's about as epic as it gets. I'm hungry though. I gotta gotta do something about that. Holy fuck, thirteen thousand three hundred and thirty seven troops. Eighteen were killed. Not as elite anymore, are they? Okay. Mainly it's just clicking away windows, <laughs> unless you disable them. But that's pretty much what this game consists of. And of course, beautiful map changes and all that. So much to statistic that you drown in it. Of course they wouldn't. Oh, well, they probably will. They'll try f for their fucking life. But it will be the death of them. They don't know it, though. Trading with Germany and Japan. A lot of it with Japan. That's good, actually. Trading with a shit ton of people. They don't seem to be too afraid of me as after what I've done, though. I guess it's better stay on my good side and not abort those trades and... Hell, I might might not even attack them. Sure, we can buy an airplane. Want to start the fucking Turkish Airlines or something? Okay, there's no point in fighting anymore. No. Look at that. Look at that. So I guess history is pretty much going uh, in the right direction. We're not in the right direction, but it's it's fairly realistic over here on this continent. But this <laughs> just fucked up here. I've never seen America do anything like this. Oh, well, the AI, of course, but... Sure. Yeah. I've played out my fantasies with a few countries. Sometimes. Good thing about America, it's... It's possible to do it without cheats. I mean, and that is not... No neutrality calculated that into. I mean, it's technically not a cheat, but... You, you get what I mean. Ah, and so it is ours. North America is entirely ours. Might do something about Central America though, but it can get quite nasty down here in the jungles. 
Um, seeing as the infrastructure is, you see, it, it starts, it starts deteriorating further down you get. And it gets quite bad, trust me. It's obviously fucking A up here, but, yeah. <laughs> Let's, uh, demobilize then. Watch things go for other things. Um, so yeah, we're gonna finish building these boats. I kind of really want to just launch a naval invasion or something with the transport fleets. Like, load up a bunch of men and land here in France or something like down here, Dakar. That'd be pretty sick. Infrastructure would be shit, though, I think. But yeah, crap. Oh, we're starting up with this now. Germany just anschlussed Austria. So they're on their they're on their good way of doing it. I'm gonna Anschluss fucking I <laughs> just Anschluss fucking <laughs> all of North America. It's so funny looking at this. Oh god. Sometimes it just it gets too much though. It's like it's like it's like I can almost mo vomit over my power. Remember when we played the Prussians in Hearts of Iron or in Victoria 2 when I owned like all of this? Like all of this here. It's pretty sick. That was a good let's play. I hope you guys enjoyed that when you watched it. I sure as hell did enjoy playing it. <clears throat> so my voice is starting to crack up. It's a good sign that I've been playing too much. And that I cannot keep up my efficiency. And there we go. The boat's just finished. I see just went down a hell of a lot. So that's good. They can continue doing what they're doing. I think the... Yeah. It's gonna be cool. Whatever happens, we'll find time for, for shit. Um, so yeah, let's deploy these boats. I'm gonna send two each to these. I wanna make these fleets real powerful. This is a pretty sick fleet. You can't deny that. Freaking carriers and fucking battleships and battle cruisers and destroyers and yeah hoorah hoorah it's pretty sick and i think we're gonna leave it there guys thank you guys for watching this has been episode three i believe taking mexico next up world war ii and we'll see what happens uh we're down here so i'm expecting to be invited by sometime by the next episode so see you guys then until then you guys enjoy Cheers. Bye. Uh, I can't. Yeah, I think my, I think my keyboard broke. Or like, wait. Yeah, my, wait, wait a second. I can't stop the recording. All right, let's see now. Yes, okay, that's why I couldn't. Say. All right, we'll end it here. Thank you guys for watching. We got a bit of a blooper there at the end, but that's always interesting, isn't it? And uh, I'll see you then. Bye.